Hey guys, this is Ada coming in with a quick word. Um, my word tonight is be strong in the Lord and the power of his might, guys. Be strong in the Lord and the power of his might. Because this word may be for a few, it may be for many, I'm not sure. But, you know, the enemy is getting busy again, according to the revelation I got, guys. Um, just when you get to the point where you've overcome a lot and you just spin ahead into that land of promise that God has promised you, the enemy get busy. And he can't use anybody but those who are close to you. So with that being said, guys, just be on the lookout and remember that we are in a spiritual battle. Because what the enemy is doing now, he's done everything he could to bring you down and try to stop what the Lord has put in your heart. Whatever ministry that is, what is a ministry of helps, where whatever your call is. And now the enemy's upset and he's kicking. And so they're getting busy again, getting ready to go and try and destroy your name again. again. Because remember, um, we're in this world, but we're not of the world. And so with that being said, if they hated Jesus, they're going to continue to hate you. Um, so just be prepared, guys, but just realize that we're to be strong in the Lord and the power of his might. And there's another scripture I would like to reference, Psalms 46, which says, It says, God is our refuge and strength and ever-present help in trouble. So just remember that God is your refuge, he's your strength, and you don't have to fear what man does because, believe me, truth will always surface. So just prepare yourself, be strong in the Lord, and just remember, after this attack, the breakthrough is here. But just don't allow yourself to be pulled down. You know, let the Lord be your refuge. And with that being said, if this video has been helpful, please give it a thumbs up. If you think someone else would benefit, please share it.